to is kicking it off uh, with Ruby's Spring Kickoff event. So joining us with more on it is Christine Eccles with the Blank Park Zoo. Chris, thanks for being here today. We yeah, my pleasure. You. So what's this uh, Ruby's uh, Spring Kickoff event? Let, let's hear about it. Sure, it's our way of kicking off spring. Yeah. So we've had perfect weather, so thanks right. to, to your crew for that. <laughs> um, <laughs> and it's just a way for us to celebrate spring. We have a Ruby the Red Panda reading program, and we also, it's a red panda who likes to read. Um, and we will have our story times every month. So we thought, let's have Ruby's kick off spring and talk about the animals and enrichment at the zoo, which enrichment is a way for our animals to be stimulated in their environment through play or smell or food, things like that. Maybe like we might give our dogs and cats some toys to play with when they have the zoomies around our house. Uh -huh. So this is a way for us to kind of engage our guests and let them know like how we take care of our animals and all the fun things that we do at the zoo. That's really cool. So I guess what is a Zoo Lovers Day sure. as a whole? What is it? In it's just a, a fun day like yeah. love your pet day or yeah. your dog day or things like that. So it's just a way to get people to come to the zoo, show us how much you love us, how much and we get to show you in turn how much we love having our visitors at the zoo and our guests. Um, we can't you know be there without our guests. They're really important so we love everybody who comes to the zoo and it's just a kind of a an excuse like I'm gonna go to the zoo today because it's Zoo Lovers Day. Right. <laughs> and it posts on social media, tell us what kind of fun you had, um, you know, share share your love for the zoo on social media. And the weather too, I mean this is kind of right when the weather starts turning here, yes. at least in the Midwest, <laughs> in Central Iowa, right? I guess, yeah, <laughs> knock on wood. So I guess, it, 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 why is it important for people to, to celebrate today, right as we're kind of getting into early spring weather? Sure, um, it's, well it's just a nice, Nice time to get out. Everybody thinks been cooped up with cold weather or storms and things like that. So we just want them to get out and enjoy nature and really connect with nature. So when you get to see an animal up close, like the otters or the tigers or the lions, you're getting to see nature right there in front of you, learn about them. And hopefully when you go home, you're like, I learned something, I had fun. What can I do to help our natural world? And you're gonna see a lot of spring flowers coming up. So how do we can help our pollinators? Mm -hmm. Um, how can we plant some flowers in your yards to see wildlife in your backyard? So hopefully you're learning that at the zoo <laughs> and then taking that home to enjoy the spring that's coming. Chris, I want like a tip or something. Well, I mean, what animals, when, when springtime is here, when, mm. when it's working its way in, thank you, Gabe, we <laughs> appreciate you. Uh, what, what animals are getting the most active? What are the most fun to see, I guess, around this oh. time of the year? What would you say? Right now, the seals and sea lions have been, I, I walked through the other day and they were just barking at each other and porpoising in the water and just having a lot of fun. They do that kind of all year, but I saw them the other day. They was like all ready for it. I think Deuce, our lion, is ready for some spring. Okay. He's been being a little more active on his rock and roaring, you know, and all that sort of stuff. So they're always a lot of fun. The giraffes are coming back out. So they've been in their barn, which they've had access to people that way, but they're going to start their coming out now that it's getting warmer. Um, so that's a fun, and we have a baby uh, giraffe that you can see, mm -hmm. um, Bakari. So he's learning the new space because he didn't really get to go out before. He was uh, too young before, so you can see him. Uh, so a lot of, just a lot of fun yeah. stuff's going on now. Ruby too, the red and panda. And Ruby the red panda. <laughs> <laughs> right, let, let, let's show people that information again here today. Ruby's spring kickoff, 10 to two. Uh, a, a lot of fun uh, a lot for of fun. families yes. out there. Yeah, so come out today, see us, go to story time, hear some keeper chats, um, pretend that you're an animal, you can pretend you're a giraffe and learn there how to go. do some enrichment as a giraffe. And just love the zoo. Just love exactly. the zoo. Exactly, exactly. All right, hey, Chris Eccles with the Blank Park Zoo. Thanks for being here this morning. Yeah, thank we you for having you. me. Hey, we'll be right back uh, with more news after the break.